Okay, so two quick things. One, the car in the video is actually my car. It's the Volkswagen Golf R. I've always been a car guy. And number two, I want to thank Zeon for sponsoring this video. That entire clip was filmed on the Crane 2S gimbal. Sleek looking black with gold trim, carbon fiber handle. And this has to be the most versatile gimbal that I've ever used. And it's mainly due to the flex mount system that it has. And you're probably wondering what the heck is a flex mount system. It has two mounts. It has a horizontal mount right here and it has a vertical mount right here. So in just about 30 seconds, you can go from horizontal to vertical video balanced ready to start shooting and now your vertical video game is going to be strong no more cropping those horizontal videos on your instagram feed because you're going to get some super smooth video i actually shot some sample clips with the r5 on this gimbal of diana in 4k 60 check it out Another dope feature of this gimbal is located right here under the bottom quick release plate. It has a couple of quarter 20 threaded holes and that allows me to attach my tripod mount on here. Why is that important? Guess what? I can just take the camera off right off the gimbal, attach it to my tripod right here or my slider or whatever I want and then I can bring it back to the gimbal and because the whole plate and everything comes off the gimbal itself, you can just attach it back on without having to balance it. That's gonna save somebody some serious time. The Crane 2S was designed for larger cameras in mind. This isn't the biggest setup, this is the R5 and the 24 to 105, but you can fit a black Magic 6K camera with a larger lens or S1H, you, get the, you catch my drift. Look at how much room there is here. There's gonna be no issues of it bumping into the motor. And another thing, if you have a camera that doesn't have a screen that flips out like the Canon R5 and this motor is obstructing your view, there's like a built-in extension on this gimbal. And all you gotta use is the Allen key. You can remove this built-in extension and now the, the motor is gonna be down here. So this you're gonna be able to see your screen perfectly fine. The Crane 2S features some really beefy locks and it might seem like a small thing, but in reality, it makes the gimbal so much more easy to use and travel with. So like when you're on location and you're done taking your shot and your gimbal's all like this, like Gumby, these locks, I mean, look, this camera is not a, it's not a light setup. I can, you know what I'm saying? Like it doesn't go anywhere. Really beefy locks on every axis. And that also makes it a lot easier to balance. It's just so rock solid that I can make precise movements really, really easy. Another nice touch that they did on top of the controls and the power button, they put a bigger screen here so that when you're navigating through the menus, you're not gonna be struggling to see it. You know what I'm saying? It's really nice and big and I really like the interface and how everything's laid out here. It's very easy to use. The modes that are included in the Crane 2S, it has a pan follow mode, which is best for general shooting. You would need to use the joystick on the gimbal to actually tilt the gimbal. It has locking mode where it locks the tilt in the pan. You would actually have to use the joystick to make any kind of movements. It has follow mode where you can tilt and pan by moving the handle around. It also has POV mode, which allows you to react faster when filming fast moving subjects. And I like it because you can get really creative with your angles. And it also has vortex mode, which gives you that cool spiral effect. There are many other features like the updated focus wheel, which will give you smoother focus pulls and updated software like the auto tune feature to really dial in that perfect balance. When I first saw this gimbal, it just reminded me of the classic gimbal that we are all used to, but the improvements that Zoom Tech did, I think make it stand out. If you're looking for versatile, easy to balance, gimbal that can handle large camera setups and give you some buttery smooth footage check out the crane 2s i'll leave a link for you down below in the description box